But there was no opportunities in which I needed um, help. So. Yeah, you think What's going on guys? Today we have a really cool video. Uh, we are visiting one of our clients, Jane Rogers, who is the director and founder of a brand called La Salty Label. They're based here on the Gold Coast. They started working with us in January 2021, see her office for the first time, and we're also going to try to ask her a whole heap of questions as well uh, to give you guys as much value on how she achieved such incredible success and such incredible growth. Excited for you to see it all. We are about to head over to the Salty label, uh, the HQ, but just have a look around here. Lots functioning on a Friday. The biggest importance on a Friday for top tier is to make sure everything's ready for, I guess, the weekend because the guys, you know, aren't really on the accounts as much as they would be throughout the week. A lot of like finalizing campaigns, ad accounts, uh, making sure that things are ready to run over the, the weekend. The guys in here are actually mapping out some uh, key development roles and responsibilities. As the agency is growing and adding more uh, services to better serve our clients, we want to make sure that the guys are well-rounded with what they're now responsible for. So uh, Christy and Ben being the leaders of our team are helping out a lot in that case. Through here, you've got Layla. Um, she is on, uh, I think, a call with a potential brand that might want to start working with us, um, which is really cool because it gives her more time to, I guess, handle that process, walk them through exactly what we offer and make sure that that brand fits with us as well. Maddie's coming with us as well um, to the Salty. We'll be leaving in about 10 minutes, um, which is going to be really exciting to go see a HQ. Queen wants to be on the show. No. Yeah. Really? Yeah, she just replied. So I followed up. I was like, did you get the pack you said? And then she was like, apologies for not being in touch. She's been a bit behind. She's on maternity leave, but she'd absolutely love to be on your YouTube series. Are you serious? Um, so she needs to RSVP through the QR code. Otherwise, please send me an email. We'll organize the time. Yeah. How good is that? Dude. Bloody oath. Congrats, man. Well, congrats to us. How sick is that? We've been like following her stuff for a while, so yeah. dude, she would give wild value. Massive. And she's growing really quickly as well. And like everyone knows who she is. That's sick. <laughs> Buddy, well done, Layla. We have been reaching out to brands uh, in very creative ways. This is the thing that we've been really focusing on to make sure that we deliver as much value as we can through the uh, heavy focus of content that we're trying to create here at Top Tips. So Maddie's just saying then that on Facebook, we have seen a huge increase in costs to advertise. On average, CPMs, which is the cost to advertise to a thousand people, have increased by like 40%, 30 to 40%. Let's say, for example, you wanted to achieve, uh, this time last year, 50,000 in sales. It might cost you 10,000 um, in ad spend to generate that 50,000 in sales. But this time, this year, um, right now, it would probably cost you around 15 to $20,000. If you're a brand that has got all of its eggs in one basket, which means you're purely just advertising on Facebook and that's your main source of income, you need to diversify your advertising strategies and you need to get across to like Snapchat and Pinterest, which is half the cost. Yeah, iOS 15. Apple's whole premise now is around privacy and protection, and it's heavily going against what email EDM uses. That's marketing. End of the day, there's like a million and one changes that happen every single day, right? And the thing about it is that it's not like you just, oh, well, we just might stop spending money on ads. I mean, like, regardless, you're gonna have to continue to invest in your marketing. It's just where to invest uh, and what changes you now have to adjust to to make sure that you're not just throwing shit at the wall and seeing what sticks. There's actually a strategy behind what you're doing and what you're investing in. So if you wanna uh, have our beautiful tailored ads on your new feed and you don't wanna be opted out, so you're, yeah you're not getting irrelevant Facebook ads and stuff. Mm. Basically, you go into your settings and it's in privacy and then tracking and it says allow apps to request to track. By default, I checked this like three days ago and this was turned off like by really? default. So you could, there wasn't even a chance for Facebook to even send me a notification. Apple's done a great job in marketing it in a way of 
well, you want to protect your privacy and stuff like that. And look, I'm actually for that too, but it has had a pretty significant impact on small businesses. I don't know. It's look, at the end of the day, there's, there's for and against arguments. I'm obviously going to have a biased standpoint and uh, I definitely want a lot of the brands that we work with to continue to be able to invest their money smart. It's, it's not the end of the world. You just got to uh, read and adjust. <laughs>
Um, I just got through my work and didn't need anyone's help this week. But I'm sure next week there will probably be someone I'll reach out to. Independent. Do you feel like too many people reach out to you so you don't have the opportunity to reach out to them? No, I'd, like re I'd reach out and ask for your advice if I needed it. Um, but Bro. this week I just, <laughs> <laughs> there, was, there was no opportunities in which I needed um, help. So. Yeah, you think you're better than everyone? <laughs> 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 yeah. Yeah. Mine's to Christy for coming back in um, this yes. week. Thanks for coming back, just hitting the ground running. That's awesome. And to Maddie today for uh, helping me start up this, this video and visiting oh. the Salty. Mine is to everyone for my first week back. I felt very welcomed and I missed you all. Um, and then to Ben, because I think you took a lot of time out this week and ran me through a lot of things. Lovely to have you back. <laughs> um, on that key note, how did everyone go with their three things this week? I got two of my three now. Okay, let's start with you, Paul. Let's go through your list. Um, I got the Google ads like offering that's like all sorted. Um, I got the first draft done for the graphic design pricing structure with uh, Ben, that's sorted, but I didn't post three TikToks this week. Did you post any? None. Nope. Oh. Okay. Three strikes <laughs> No. <laughs> three goals each week that has to be completed. If you don't complete one of them, there is a challenge that you have to do. And these challenges are normally quite Funny for us, humiliating for the person that has to do it. So this week it was another funny dance video to show you guys once my computer isn't frozen. And we will do if that. If it doesn't show, we don't have to do it. Right the <laughs> <That's> <laughs> Thanks so much for tuning in, guys. <laughs> my computer is frozen, so I think you did get out of doing an embarrassing video, but I will send it through the group so everyone can watch what it was because it's very funny. Well, why don't you How about call my last lunch? Someone else's laptop. Yeah, I'll shout lunch for everyone. Yeah, you can one, shout lunch. One, you have to also shout us lunch. <laughs> 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 second one, you just have to come up with the best funny story so not a funny joke this week it has to be a good paragraph story it has story. to be the best I it has to be the best story yeah. a start a middle and an end <laughs> <laughs> and you have to stand up when you say it uh, okay Ooh. Ooh. we'll have to cut this one because you this is when i was a de degenerate so that pretty much wraps up today's video. It's so exciting to be able to interview the likes of Jane, uh, the owner of La Salty. Uh, that again, like I said, guys, is coming out in our top tier show. This, this channel, this, this playlist that we've got on our YouTube channel is going to pop off. Some of the brands and some of the big influencers on the Gold Coast that we have coming up and scheduled in to sit down and have an interview with us are huge names with huge value that they're gonna bring to you guys who are watching these videos. I seriously can't wait for July to actually start coming around so we can start releasing these videos. I know you guys are gonna be absolutely thrilled with the people that we had on. If you haven't subscribed already, please do click that subscribe button down below make sure you like the video if you have any burning questions i want to see them in the comments because we are basing these videos based around what you guys want to see other than that i will see you in the next video